this video, I'm going to show you how to control your LG smart television from your iPhone. So you can actually use your iPhone as a TV remote control, and this is a lot easier than it sounds. So the first thing we need to do is just ensure that your TV and your iPhone are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So if I just click on my settings on my iPhone and I click on Wi-Fi, you can see that I'm currently connected to this VM178 network, and I need to ensure that this is the same network that I'm connected to on my television. Now, once you've done that, we can go and open up the app store on your phone. From the app store, go and use the search box to type in LG TV and then press search. And then we need to scroll down and download this application here, which is remote control for LG and just click on the download button next to it. So as you can see, I already have this application installed. So I'm just going to go and press open. Now, what you'll need to do is go and select your remote control from the list of options. So there's a few different remotes to choose from. So I'm going to click on this one as this is the remote control that I have. Once you've selected your remote, you need to click on continue and you may get these pop ups asking to allow access to the application. Click on allow while using the app and then just press allow once again. Now, once you've done that, as long as your TV is turned on, it should be detected in this list of available devices. Just go and select your TV. And now that's going to ask for a six digit code that you need to enter into your iPhone. Now, this code should be displayed on your television like so. And you'll just need to go and enter the code exactly how you see it on the TV. Once you've entered the code, press submit. And now, just like that, we can control our television using this remote control. So I can press any of these buttons like so. And as you can see, it will turn up the volume and turn down the volume and things like that. Let me know in the comments if you did find this video helpful and I'll see you with the next one.